Did you understand that? That's beige for I'm hungry. For me, that's how it sounds. But for the 35,000 beekeepers out there in Romania, communicating with the bees requires 33 hours manual work per week, without which 80% of the hives would be in danger. We, at Binocular, consider that each bee should be empowered to speak and be understood. We want to give bees a voice, a translator, since they ha can have a human voice. Through, through sensors, the, bee, the hive will be constantly monitored, thus saving the beekeeper effort, time, and possibly costly dangers. The market in Romania is quite big. We are currently on the fourth place in the European Union as honey producers. We are planning to sell B to B to C in partnership with telecom providers to, par to businesses that collect the honey from the beekeepers. Our revenues will be regular on a monthly basis, use, uh, offering hardware and software. The innovative, B, uh, the innovative thing behind binocular is the sound analysis, which integrated with forecasting and analytics can empower each one of you to be a native b speaker. Another important thing here is uh, the team behind the software and the product. With Catalin, a computer science student with a passion for sound analysis, and the rest of us working in multinational companies, Sunziana as a software developer, George in the electric industry, and myself as a business analyst, and through my dad, who has the know-how of beekeeping through his hobby, we are sure that soon binocular will be out there. And speaking of that, we made an evaluation of our proof of concept, and we estimated three months and $40,000 to make it real. I leave you with one thing. The next time you hear B sound, imagine what she will tell you through binocular, the buzzing monitor. <laughs>